I'm still doing it into the recording. You I'm were. ruining your life. Yeah. I do this yeah. all day. Boy. No one gives a shit about Pikmin. If you want a good Pikmin place, go to watch Chug Conroy. He's right. David sucks. I'm just here. <sighs> yeah. We gotta go back here. Why are you even near? People are dying. Oh shit! <laughs> There's a lot of parts here. And besides, we don't have enough, you know. We can't go higher to go explore new places just yet. I'm sorry. Zolomar sucks. But, I was playing Broadway, and I actually won with Zolomar. Oh, yeah? I, I was actually surprised that Zolomar was a broad character, in there's a way. A, there's a reason why. We were, playing at Newport, we were playing in New Park City, which is a map from Mother 3. Uh-huh. So basically what I did was, um... Shit, um... We were just hiding there. We were playing to where, like, if you, the person... Who dies the least? Uh -huh. Is there? I just went up and hid. Oh yeah. <laughs> so I just hid up there, and then once the once the time went out, I was like, everyone was like, holy shit, oh, I won. And I was like, I bet, I was like, I bet that was the first time Almar's ever won a brawl match. Yeah, I I just don't find Almar to be really good, and Big Pigman Big. isn't really much of a help thing for him, so. Well, like, he throws them. No, it was actually pretty good. What? Who? Rob the robot's actually pretty good. Yeah, Rob's pretty good. He did a lot better because I was like, basically, what I was doing was I was picking shitty characters. Oh. So I was like ice climbers, and I finally figured out how to do their special moves. Uh huh. I never knew how to do it. Like, I, I thought you had to press certain buttons. But apparently, you just have to break those circle things. Oh yeah, the smash ball. I did not know that. Oh look. We just killed some new enemies. I don't. I don't, can't remember what they are right now because I don't have my notes. But put an annotation. Well, pretty much the white, purplish ones. They're female. They can't hurt you. But the dark purple ones. They're male. They can hurt you. I thought it was the females that can hurt you. No, females can't hurt you. They usually just run away. Male ones have the the. You know, you can't really see what I'm doing, but the pincher mouths, I guess. Miyamoto is sexist, too. Oh, my God. What? What? what, what oh. That the females don't fight and run away? I actually think women are pretty strong. You know, because I'm trying to get, like, like, I'm trying to get on the girl's side. Like, you look well, fabulous I, today. I, maybe, maybe in Japan they do things a little different. Well, wait, I better just stop while I'm ahead. Yeah, you're going to get the entire Japanese-American... People on our ass. Oh, if, if I'm if I was commentating with, with this with Alex, I would have already lost the world. Alex, he seriously needs to stop. I'm on the verge of not talking to him anymore. Anyway. Well, he'll end up watching this. So. No, I'm not racist at all. Really? Right. And if he's just like being like that, exactly. I just think it's funny that he, he of all people, is making fun of it. Because he's like the generic Mexican kid. <laughs> uh, well, anyways, um, of course, this is a black, I guess, well, I'll just call them wooden walls. Um, I forgot about those guys. Oh, yeah, I guess that's a radar, in a way. It's apparently supposed to search for parts, but... Like, I think this is what makes the stars appear on your map now. But, um, anyways, uh, we'll encounter, like, the same kind of walls, but if it's a different shade of color, the black walls, apparently, take a little bit longer to tear down. Um, but a faster trick with wooden walls, if you got yellow pinkmen, you can, uh, make wooden walls pretty much collapse, and you don't have to spend all day, uh, trying to blow them up, but I think I've used most of the bomb rocks for the day, and at least the good thing is, the bomb rocks do respawn the next day, but look, there is some in the can, and I probably don't even use them, because that's me. Oh, well, I am picking them up. What I think is cool, what they did with the second Pikmin game, is they actually get, let you switch out which character you're using. Oh, yeah, between, um, Louis and Almar. See, what they should have done... Because I know there was the challenge mode in Pinkman 2, but what they should have done, Pinkman 2 should have been a co-op game throughout the story in a way. Yeah. Because that that would have you could have got so much done, like 
all you could you have Almar like collect stuff like above ground, and have someone like Louie, you know, go underground and collect like fight bosses and stuff, and you could you you could just end up breaking records because of that though. Well, maybe they do, maybe they're doing that with Pikmin Three, even though I have no idea how they're going to involve a story with it. What? What reason is this guy from Planet Hockey Take going to make you return back to... I, I don't know, really. I mean, I'm sure they'll come up with some, but... Because, you know, in this one, it's just he's exploring space, and he crash lands in this on this planet, and he has to find his ship parts before his air runs out. And then the second one, when he comes back, they discover a lot of items on this planet is apparently to them like millions of dollars and so th I guess it was the mayor or whatever sends Almar and Louie back here to fix the funds and repay their debt yeah. for their planet which I oh you killed your pick oh well, it happened which I think is stupid is that you work so much just to repair your ship just for it to get taken away oh yeah I hated that because like in the cutscene showed you land and then you just see this thing just come and pick up your ship. I was like, what the hell? So he just wasted, he just wasted 30 days of his life. But, yeah, I'm not sure what they'll do for Pinkman 3. Isn't there 25 necessary items and then 5? Yeah, there's... You can beat the game with, um... With just 25 ship parts. But then there's, like, 5 items that you don't need to get. Can um, we? one of them is actually nearby. It's like a rocket booster thing or something. That was like, isn't one of them like a butt massager or something? It's something like, yeah, massager for your ass. <clears throat> no, I, I kind of feel sorry for these things that they're just dead. Um, well, an interesting fact that I found when looking up stuff, uh, we won't meet them in this because... Um, I just didn't worry about it. But, uh, the impact site, the first area we were at, uh, if you go back there any time after day eight, I think, might, might be day seven, but, um, there'll be two types of monsters. There's, like, this Musha thing. I th Isn't there, like, a blue monster there? Oh, yeah, yeah, there's him, and then there's this blue one. Of course, the blue thing is just made out of water, and there's, like, this nerve cell, which... Of course, when we get to Blue Pikmin later, those are the only ones that can go for water. But uh, I, what I learned about the Musha Musha or Mumamata or whatever his name is, he's apparently the god of the Pinkmen. But the Pinkmen are apparently only rep are here to do one thing, and they're they're only supposed to be flowers. He can't kill the Pinkmen, but he smacks them and he turns them back to what they're supposed to be like. What, just the buds? Yeah, like, the well, he turns them into, like, flowers. And where they're just, you know, you just see them sprouts coming out of the ground. Like, before you pick them out. Is it the thing that, that's, like, flying around? Uh, well, that thing does it too, but, um, I, I can show you a picture later. I think he's in Pikmin too as well. But is it... He's the god of the Pikmin. Yeah, he's he's like this big thing. Like all he is is like a fa like his face is part of his torso, but then his arm. But these he has long arms and like he doesn't really have legs. He kind of just has feet that walks around. But uh, yeah, he's only located in the impact site though. Isn't so, he like a, is he like a spider? No, he's he's not a spider. He's probably the closest thing to like a human creature. Well, we'll, we'll just wait until we run into him. But he has, like, historian marks around his arms and stuff. But, uh, yeah, he can't kill him, like I said. He just returns him back to their But you first can kill day. him. Yeah, you could kill him. Well, that's it, fucked up. If you can kill a god. It, it, so, yeah, it's like a, maybe the closest thing where your pink men are, like, a hundred Kratos versus one big Zeus. But the thing is stupid is Kratos, Kratos sees this game, he gets pissed off because... He's like, oh shit, I, kill I had to work so much just to get one box to kill one god, yet somehow I'm able to kill all the rest of the gods with no problem as a mortal. Uh, uh, there's another ship part right there that looks like a rocket. That's one of the five that you don't need. You got hurt again. What a noob. Uh, yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh, my voice crack. Yeah. I don't like this method of killing them. I mean, yes, it's quicker. Well, I'm rushing them. 
but um, sometimes I find, especially when you get to the more upgraded versions of them, I, I find them just more difficult. Where, where when you go to just charge by their feet, by the time they get up to attack, they die. So. Isn't it like bomb rushing what Chugger Gonry does? Yeah, that's what he does. I mean, any method works. I, I mean, this is my method, just the charge and the kill. Because odds are, if you have a lot of strong pink men, they'll die by the time they try to eat you. Isn't in the new Pikmin game there's two new types of the white ones and the purple ones? Yeah. Of course, the white ones were poison effective. Yeah. And the purple one were weight sensitive kind of creatures. They're also really overpowered. Right. Like, of course, like we've noticed, like things like from the first day, where if you needed ten Pikmin to move a box, purple ones you really only need like three or five because of their their power. But like you like Chug Con Chug Conray, like you really didn't need to use like, he like didn't use a lot of them because he thought it was cheap. We we're really giving a lot of shout outs to him. Right. Nova Blaster. Yeah, the Nova Blaster. Half of these ship parts you don't really see them like in use. You know that's stupid. What? You could just use that Nova Blaster to shoot that asteroid. You're probably right. But I think he might have not have saw it, so... No one ever said all of was smart guy. No. But I, if I could... I think his IQ is a little bit bigger than Louis. Louis is a stupid dumb shit, so... You got, like, one bomber. You got one bomber. But, um... Of course, if... It, with the ones just still holding the rock, they won't do much. Up there is a 20 pellet. The biggest pellets in the game. And of course, 20 of the same color will give you 40. And that would have sucked if I, I had him explode while they were all still up there collecting that. But, um, at this point, I've collected three ship parts, which is pretty good on the third day. Uh, there's not too many parts here left. All there really is at the Forest of Hope is two. Why didn't, they, why didn't they come out? What? The seeds. Oh, because I already have a hundred out on the field. Will they come out later? No, they like already mature inside oh, the okay. ship. But um, yeah, there's only like there, there's two parts like regular parts left, and I think there's like two boss fights I gotta do. Uh, one of the parts I can't get just yet. I need the last race of pink men. As you can see, certain pellets, like this one, can change different colors for some odd reason. I feel like I'm some random nature guide. Crikey, look at that fucking changing thing. I want to fucking kill it. I want to put it in my mouth and make, call it daddy. And it kind of sucks over. when you're trying to get like a certain color, but then right as soon as you kill the flower, it changed. I just noticed you said color weird. Really. Yeah, I kind of just. You say collar, like you're I, talking about like. I, I say a lot of words weird. I say water. Water. I have a couple friends that say like water and stuff. I gotta go water my vagina down. It smells. I'd rather buy a Vagisil, but I don't know. I mean, is that what you guys do? Do you spray water? I don't know. Febreze it. And at, at this part, there really isn't going to be much left. I got what I needed. Uh, it's pretty much just harvest. Uh, so you don't have to stick around if you don't want to. You can go ahead and go to the next p or day or part, whatever is up, if you like. Because they, really, they're you're gonna see me either harvest pinkmen or just skip to sunset. You're cheap. They already got you. You're like, oh, I already got your view. So I'll just get the fuck out of here. My next. Well, one. I mean, really, if you want to stay, that's that's okay. I mean, if you want to stick stick around, you know, for a harvest. But I mean, you're gonna see this multiple times. It's kind of like porn. Once you're done masturbating, you can stick around. I mean, you're gonna see it plenty of other times. Well, I mean, it's gonna help me for the future because I'll have. A lot of pinkmen. As you can see, my total number is 243. Is that your sperm count? Yes. Because you see how clear and white that is? Probably clear is not good. 
Oh, and check your map. Then you pretty much just clear coming water. Oh. I guess you're in no danger of having kids, though. But, uh... STDs are still out there, man. If you don't want those, then you can get your willy chopped off. But, uh... Pretty much the countdown, this is right now. Just go as fast as you can. Look for anyone that's left behind. I wonder if you even get any left behind. I, I know I eventually you, I think, do. I think you get all these guys. Yeah, I think I get these guys. I eventually will. It will happen. So... Otherwise, these four things are going to die. Yeah, but it happens. <laughs> well, technically, like, if there's supposed to be flowers, all March is fucking... Why would he pull, like, things out anyway? Why would you pull out a newborn plant? Because Almar is a slave driver? What he is. But yet, they seem to obey orders. So, I guess, in a way... The pink men look up to him like a mother. She's like mind fear, or more like she's just like a dictator that everyone likes. I guess. Well, anyway, this part is coming to a close. Shit, my balls! Don't be like a doctor. So this part's coming to an end. Check us now on part four, part five. Well, this part five. This is part five of our piece of pay through. But um, yeah, pretty much it all shows the chart every day, shows your progress, say so whatever. But I guess we'll see you in, in the morning of day four. Hello, everybody. Oh, look, it's Pooh Bear.